Good morning, folks. Skaters Outdoor Adventures and Guide Service. Now, what we're getting ready to do up in Sparkleberry Swamp is we're going to hit up these lily pads. Now, I, it took me a while to find these fish, and it's going to look easy, but it wasn't. I'm going to talk to you a little bit, and uh, it's going to be mainly fishing. But what I got going on here is I'm in the Warrior one-man boat, and powered by Dakota Lithium batteries. I got the ACC crappy stick, the GSM-11M. It can be found over there in uh, fishusa.com. ACCCrappySticks.com uh, Probably some of your local bait and tackle shops You have to get on ACC Crappy Sticks uh, website Check the dealer, see if they got it updated um, If not, shoot Andy and them boys uh, an email They'll reply back to you and let you know where the closest place is Or you can shoot me a message but anyway y'all can see we done started catching shell crackers some know them as red ear it's gonna be a good video I appreciate y'all uh, we are using the number two red true turn hook by TTI Blakemore this hook is made in the USA and it ain't it's, it's, it ain't come from no China made in the USA you get what you pay for um, the best hook on the market I, it's sharp it's durable <coughs> dependable you'll see uh, it worked it held up good in these lily pads you also see these fish ain't taking that cork down they just bumping that cork just bumping it but uh I hope y'all enjoy this video. I'll uh, get something from it. Leave me a message if you got any questions or something. You know, I'll get to you. This uh, YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, all this stuff is, is tough. Rumble, I got that started now. So, trying to keep up with all of it. It's a little bit, little, little job. I got some good shell cracker videos coming. This is one of the few. But like I said, y'all sit back, enjoy this show. Those of you that haven't uh, liked it, subscribe, comment, do so. We'd appreciate it. We really would. Um, I'm trying some different angles, trying some different stuff. And it's hard to set up these kind of angles and stuff on these fish when you you ain't found them so it, it took me a while to find these fish i narrowed them down i found them got the camera set up and here we go okay we, i mean i caught some nice fish really nice fish but i can't tell y'all how much i appreciate each and every one of you thank you um like I said, big shout out to Windrider Gear. Uh, they also sell my logo shirts. Um, you can get the Gator Outdoor Adventures and Guide Service shirt. It's a Windrider shirt with my logo on it. They got several different options. So reach out to them if you would like one of those shirts. We appreciate it. Thank you for showing us you know, your support. But you subscribe to our channel. It, it means a lot to us. Getting a shirt is a bonus. Um, Dakota Lithium batteries, yeah, they're unbeatable. Um, you know how it goes. Everybody's got their batteries, favorite batteries. I got mine, and it's Dakota Lithium. They've been holding up good for me, and I can't, I, I, I can't compare them to nothing else. Uh, Fish USA, they keep me supplied with everything I need. I can go online and order it in two days flat, 
I got it. It's just like ACC traffic stick. Order something from there. Two days, it's sitting on the doorstep. Uh, two turns. You can get that at tpiblakemore.com or you can get it at fishusa.com. Fishusa.com has got them same number two red crappy panfish hooks. Um, you can't, like I said, you can't beat them hooks. I'm probably leaving somebody out. But ATX lures, those of y'all that crappy fish, check them out. They, they got some good plastics. I'm telling you, they, they step in their game up here in 2024. Um, pop crappy jigs. We working on some brim tail cracker jigs. And we about ready to start showing them things off. They, they work it. I like my green worms, but the green worms is getting way too high. And they done put them in, in a different container, and I don't like the container. And uh, I don't like paying that kind of money for them worms because I go through 10 to 20 a day, depending on how much we fish. So, right here, I'm by myself. I use anywhere from four to eight because I feed the fish. I, I, I show them appreciation and keep them around. Give y'all another little heads up. I want y'all to think about those of you that shell cracker fish that's taking all these females out of these holes. If you'll throw them females back, them males will have a reason to come up in them showers and keep coming in them showers. Male after male after male after male. The females ain't as populated as them males are. It's like going into a strip club. You go into a strip club, take all the girls out, the men ain't coming back. So, you gotta leave the ladies. If you'll leave them ladies, you'll be able to catch plenty of fish. So I, I want you to look at it like that and think about it. Take it to heart. We all take the females out. We, we do. We, we're all guilty of it. Even myself, but I've been doing a lot better with it. Now with, with my clients, we'll mix it up a little bit. But me, myself, I ain't coming out with very many because I like going back and that's what I'm doing here. I've been fishing this hole for two weeks, hadn't seen a boat, and I've been in that one little area, about a 50 foot diameter chasing these fish around and around in a circle. And the um, fish, the, the bite has been strong. And you can't beat it. But y'all sit back, enjoy the show, and we'll, we'll, we'll dive back in here here in a little bit and talk to you some more. We're using the 10 pound ACC co-polymer fishing line. Um, it'll be on the market here soon and reels they got reels coming to the coming to the market so it's, it's getting good ACC crapper stick is uh, is a big game changer they, they, they get ready to take over the industry
folks, y'all can tell that these fish are light bite. They are barely tapping that hook. So that cork it ain't hardly moving. And that's what I like about these corks. batteries on his GoPros. Man, they die so quick. And they got up against them lily pads. You find a little hole and go right down beside it. It's like they lay it on them stem. See that? Snatch them right out of there. Telling you, them three turn hooks to you pick it. Time. I, I thank all of you for watching and supporting me. I appreciate it. And I'd like to thank my sponsors. ACP Crafting Street, Pop Crafty Jigs, Fish USA, Dakota Lithium, ATX Lures, um, Futon, Dakota Lithium. They help make this trip possible, along with all the rest of the trip. And like I said, I got my Facebook, TikTok, Instagram. Y'all can check all that out and keep up with me. Those of you wondering how to book a trip, it's Gators Outdoor Adventures and Guide Service.com or Santee Cooper Catfishing.com. You can get some information off of there off the website. Those of you that want me to get the Windrider uh, shirts with my logos on them, go to windridergear.com. I'll try to post the link for them uh, Wind Rider logo shirts. And I'm going to work on that channel membership also. Let's talk about that for a minute. I'm going to uh, get that figured out and whatever I got to do. YouTube's changed up a bunch of do's and don'ts and cans and paints so I got to get all that figured out and try to see how I'm going to do it but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start putting um, offering you know GPS coordinates on Lake Marion and, and more people I have like a little subscription where you can pay for it 50, 100, 150 brush piles, something like that. I'll pay for shelf at the bed where their their bed where their bed where they bed at every year. And you'll have coordinates to it. I'm trying to get it all figured out. Yeah, I'm 
see these fish just flat in that really bad. It's literally non stop action. Averaging about a fish a minute. ATC Trapper's Pick has took a beat. Keeps on tip. Unload. It just keeps coming. It won't stop back. Like I said, I've been fishing in, in that hole, that one little area there, for two weeks. No boats, no body. That's what I like about the swamp. Which I'm deep in there. But anyway, I, I got in there and I started on one set of lily pads. And then the next day they were still on the lily pads. And then the next day they kind of shifted a little bit and I, I just kept fishing around and I found them and it's like they're going in a little circle up in that you know it, it ain't 50 75 feet in a circle of motion at the most and just go around in that circle and find them and they'd be in the lily pad on brush tops in between the trees back there behind them Hanging out of battery on the GoPro now on the, on the bow of the boat. Y'all can see them boats go to stay there. You can stand up in them, lean, lay. But we don't promote it. We, we don't suggest you stand up and walk around in them boats. They're made to sit down in and fish out of. But you can see from the video me standing up there moving around. You got a little bit of balance, you'll be alright. If not, you might get wet. But anyhow, I'm gonna let y'all finish watching this up. We appreciate you. Thank you. God bless each and every one of you. I hope y'all enjoy the rest of this video. Thank you again.